Coach, it's the new year. You're uh, by yourself this year, coaching by yourself. That's going to be fun. Uh, yeah, it'll be all right. Um, I mean, I've, you know, I've been doing it for so long, I can manage my time. I broke up my practices. I got JV's, JV slash C team coming in right after school, and then I'll bring my varsity in at about 4.30. They could do their warm-ups, and we'll get started at 5. I'm also going to be having my middle school. I split my middle team, my middle school up. My A team will come up here and practice with the during this time so I can keep an eye on what's going on down there and make sure that we're all on the same page and and then I'll have a little bit of help with that with them and then you know with the two of us in here with these kids so are you going to have a C team this year or will it just be JV uh, how is that going to look we're going to we're going to be one team but we do have some C team games I think I have about eight of them and so um I will, there will be kids that will just strictly play C team and then possibly get into the, some of the JV games. I'm going to try to get everybody as much playing time as I can. But the JV does have a full schedule. They will have a full 17 games. You got a lot of seniors this year for your varsity. Uh, you looking for a good year? I am. I have a good group of kids that are, that are going to be up there, and I do have a big group of seniors that have been here, and they're ready to, ready to go and win and they're they're working really hard we look good right now so it's it's going to be a good year how many seniors did we finally end up with this year let's see i have uh, get my camera. i'm sorry i need to count holly uh, autumn um i have the two camerons i have holly i have autumn um so basically, pretty much, yeah, you're it's, starting. It's my starting. Literally, my starting team is seniors, with the exception of Jaden and Kerrigan. I mean, that's those. Are, that's. I mean, that's it. So you look at well, and you'll be looking forward to a good year then this year. Yeah, I'm excited. We're excited. They're they're doing a great job. So we move some people around. We our offense will be a little bit different. We're going to run a five-one. So that means I'm just running a one setter instead of the two setters and. Um, uh, we moved, we moved some people into different spots, and hopefully it'll work out. You don't have a lot of tall ones this year, though, so the net's going to be an issue for you? I don't think so. You know, I mean, uh, Cameron Maletta can jump. Uh, Autumn can get up. Right now, it's, they're, they're doing good at the net, and we've worked, they've been working a lot. You know, they did some, we did a lot of summer stuff, and these kids that came are a lot of the kids that, that play. Um, and so the, their vertical has gotten a lot better. So, you know, I, I know we don't have that little bit of height, but I'm, I'm not too worried about it. You know, they're getting up and over the net. So I think we'll be all right. Are you going to try to keep uh, Cameron and uh, Autumn up front? Well, Cameron was going to be our setter. She will be running the 5-1. Um, uh, she will set all the way around. Um, but that gives her a lot of options in the front row when she's in the front row, you know. So... Um, She'll be in the. She'll be there. I just. I haven't figured out my ro like my rotation yet. On you know, do I want to separate them? Do I want to keep them together? How do I want to do that? You know, or do I want Cameron with Kerrigan or, or what I have, thought about that. But, it's. I mean, we'll get it figured out. <laughs> well, you've got what a JV game coming up first, and then you start with the varsity. Yeah, we have a J. We this Saturday we go to a scrimmage. The varsity does it. It, uh, at De for Desert Academy, they're doing a scrimmage, and there's quite a few teams down there. And, and then uh, Tuesday, the 22nd, we play Des Moines, but it's our JV that plays there. And I don't know if he's bringing his JV or his varsity, because he does have, uh, he has kind of a lot of kids too, so not as many as I do, but enough, I think, for two teams. So. Okay, well, congratulations, Coach, and we'll look forward to a good year. All right, thank you, Marty.